name is Jensen Casey and I am owner of Baby O and I Consulting. And I got this question asked to me the other day and I really wanted to address it because this mom came to me and she was really upset. She, um, her child was a little bit older, he's three and a half, and she really felt like she kind of missed the boat. She felt like she had um, opportunities to do sleep training or do some other things, but things were always coming up. Her child had gotten sick. They had moved. They had had another sibling. Um, and she just never felt like things were lined up in order to be able to make some sleep changes for her child. So when we hopped on the phone together, one of the first things she asked me was, is it too late to sleep train my child? And the answer is no. It is never too late to do anything in life, really. This is going to be a talk about sleep, but this is like now turning into a life lessons video. Um, but really, it's never too late to make any changes that you want regarding sleep or not, if it is something that is important to you. So it's never too late to learn a new hobby. It's never too late to pack up and move to a place you've always wanted to live. It's never too late to make changes to your current habits to better fit the life that you envision yourself living. So no, it is never too late to sleep train. Um, sleep training is going to look a lot different depending on the age of your child, but that doesn't mean that there are not things that you can do to help them be able to fall asleep a little bit easier and to remain asleep overnight, especially at three and a half. Um, there's just a lot more that comes into play. They now have imagination. Um, they're most likely in a bed and can just get up and walk out. There's more safety concerns. Um, all of that. They can respond and understand and talk back. So that's definitely something too. Um, I've had some three and a half year olds, my own included, say some pretty funny things at bedtime um, and get really like philosophical <laughs> and have things that they want to say too. So I wanted to make this video just in case that was you and that was how you were feeling, that you had some opportunities, but you maybe didn't take the chance. Um, you're feeling hopeless and like it's too late and that your child is just destined to never be a good sleeper because you didn't make those changes when they were younger. And I don't want you to feel hopeless. I don't want you to feel like it's too late. It is never too late. So if you are struggling with a child that you may be thinking is older, um, maybe not that classic like baby four month period where children do some sleep training, um, know that it's not too late. I personally work with children up until age four, but there are consultants that work with teenagers. There are consultants that work with adults. So it really is never ever too late to change and add to and assist a bedtime routine and overnight strategies to be able to get that good, nice restorative sleep that everybody is looking for. Everybody needs to be able to survive. So if you have any questions, um, you know you want to make those changes, you're not sure what the next steps are, you can reach out to me. I am more than happy to explain what uh, the process could look like at this age and then hop in and get started so you can all get sleep as soon as possible.